Good morning, everybody. This is Kyle from Airman Prepper. Uh, I'm gonna coming to you live from inside today, since Mother Nature decided to rain on us. Um, today, I'm gonna review the two packs that I use the most. I have several other backpacks that I use, but these are the main two. Uh, the one I use for hiking is a Patagonia uh, Next Pack. Um, that I got from uh, Leo Hardesty of Irish Zombie Nation and then the other is of course my EDC pack now you've seen my tactical bag review that was my first impressions review this is a continuation this is what I've experienced uh, using it for several weeks now so let me turn this camera around and I'll show you what I'm talking about okay everybody so this is the Patagonia uh, HB2 next pack um, first off you'll notice it's got the shock cord um, up front for attaching gear up here it's got molly webbing along the side so you can attach anything to the front gear loops on the bottom and then the one thing I love about this which is this right here this pocket allows you to get directly into the bag from outside doesn't have to go all the way to the, to the top and undo the top and all that then of course it's got this side it's got a mesh pouch and a little zipper pocket here and then this other side it has a another zipper pouch here and a zipper pouch here um, it's got compression straps excuse me all the way all the way along here so you can easily get into it and on the back it's got a robust Uh, a robust handle um, for easily hauling it up on your back uh, it's got these load lifter straps which are um, really really good they they really haul it up and um, allow you to keep the load very centered on your back uh, it's got a couple of D-rings here for attaching gear and then it's got your uh, sternum strap here which is fully adjustable up and down and then um, this hip belt is really really robust um, I mean if you look at the size of this buckle honestly um, it's got mesh along here to keep you cool it, it, and it does keep you cool it's actually really good at that um, moving up top here uh, it's got a um, zipper pocket here uh, to get into like maps and stuff like that and then in the on the top it has uh, molly webbing so you can attach any gear that you want which is where I usually normally put my tent moving back around to the front here you pop these two tabs and this is the other thing I like about this pack um, this hood raises up and doesn't doesn't actually come off which I like because that makes it less likely you're gonna lose it then you come to this strap here which um, allows you to compress this as well as acts as a second stay to keep the load inside it's got a drawstring here and a draft hood 
Um, it's got a very large interior. And it holds a lot, a ton. Okay, moving on to this pack. This is that Drago uh, Tracker Assault backpack that I showed in my uh, tactical backpack video. I've been using this as a EDC pack for a couple months now and it's really worked out really good. One thing that does, it helps, it's, it's really good but it's really annoying too, is this strap here because you have to um, uh, undo it in order to get to the main compartments. And the other thing I've found is that if you don't actually have the load centered on your back, it tends to shift quite a bit. Um, these load lifters are not easy to grab a hold of, and this waist belt is just might as well not even be there. Um, It's just, it's the belt, the buckles, as you can tell, have come off pretty much. Um, so, um, but other than that, other than those few little problems, it's a great little bag. Um, I really, I really enjoy using this every day. I'm going to turn this camera around and uh, show you what it looks like on me. Okay, first guys is the um, Patagonia. As you can tell, I have a relatively small torso. And this pack fits me perfectly. And um, it, as you can see, the waist belt is very very rigid um, as you can see it's very close to my body it, it's the straps are really wide so it makes it really easy to haul the load um, so that's what that's what that pack looks like okay guys this is the um, the uh, Tracker, Drago Tracker backpack. Um, as you can see, it also fits my frame very well. And both of these I have loaded up completely. And they still are perfect. Okay, guys. So those are the two packs that I use the most. Now, I will use other packs, but like I said, those are the two that I love the most. Um... Like I said, that hiking backpack fits me to a T, honestly. Um, so, like I said, I want to thank Leo Hardesty um, for uh, trading with me. And uh, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Uh, and you can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram on Twitter and Instagram, it's Scream and Prepper. And on Facebook, it's Kyle Logan. So, thank you. Have a good afternoon.